me, this is Jane from Jane's Videos, back with another Tombstone Review. This Tombstone Review is on the Jemmy Retro Radio Halloween prop from Target for, Hollow for the 2015 Halloween season. Let's start the review. First off, this is a very cool prop, just from the looks and everything. Um, as you can see, down here it says R.I.P. Ghoul Tone. Um, so I would assume it's pretty much symbolizing the company that supposedly <laughs> made the the radio. You have all these different numbers here. This is a sticker. This isn't a sticker. This is actually printed on. But this is a sticker right here. This is actually a sticker which is pretty much just showing you the directions to turn this in. But I don't really want to take that off because it's not very noticeable in the first place. You can see the creepy cloth here, and this is plastic. Just really cool looks. Here it is right there, and this is obviously kind of clear see-through, so you can see the lights as they shine through. There's the side, the back, which has the module, which this is the battery compartment. Um, this, These are all the modes, sensor. Try me and on. And there's the speaker. It's not a very loud prop, but it's okay. There's the other side. There's the top of it. And there is the bottom, which has this little instruction manual in battery usage. I don't really know why it needs instructions, but okay. Um, you can see just the looks on it are really cool. The sensor is actually right here. Right there is the sensor. And it is also it's motion activated and sound activated, I believe. And the the um, phrases are longer on um, the on mode and the sensor mode than they are on the try me mode. So I have it on the on mode, and I'll let you listen to all the phrases. Let me get to the first phrase so I don't get confused with this. The first phrase I always listen to, at least. We interrupt this radio broadcast for a special news bulletin. Dracula sighted in the greater metropolitan area. Citizens are advised to stay indoors until daylight, preferably with garlic, steaks, and holy water.
Okay, so those are all the phrases. I believe it has six phrases, and it is a very, very, very cool prop. And the phrases vary from, well, actually, no, they don't. If you put it this way, it'll go through that series of phrases I just went to. But if you wind it backwards, it'll go back to the previous one, as you can see. So that is actually really, really cool. I'm going to get it on this one. Um, I think that's really, really cool about it. You can see the the bulbs inside pretty much resembling tubes for the retro radio. They look really cool because they do flicker a little bit. They look like the rusty rat attic lights that stores are selling this year. And then there's these lights right here, as you can see, which look really cool. I just love how cool this prop looks. So, um, quality, um, quality is very good on this prop, as you can see, it is very durable, um, I wish the quality here was a little bit better, this is just plastic and it's kind of flexible here, so it could break if you use too much force on it, but it's still good quality, so, um, Next we have scariness. It's not it's it's a very it's a creepy looking old retro prop, but it's not supposed to be scary. So I'm not gonna take any points off for that because it's not supposed to be scary. Um appearance, the appearance is something really cool about this prop that I really like about it. So that's really cool. Um functions, the functions are really cool. I love how it functions, very great. And the price, the price could be a little cheaper, uh, which is one of the complaints I have with this. The price could have been a little bit cheaper on this. Uh, maybe like, I know it's a, it's, it's not too big, but it's kind of big in a way. But the price could have been a little cheaper still, maybe like $20, like a uh, haunt former Mac said on his review of this. I agree, it could have been like $20. Uh, $25 is a little pricey for this, especially since it doesn't have any movement, it just lights up and talks. But, so that gives it an 8 out of 10 skulls on the tomb, I mean jack-o'-lanterns. I've been watching too many tombstones, I mean RIP reviews again. <sighs> 8 out of 10 jack-o'-lanterns on the tombstone review rating scale which is very good and I highly recommend this prop and it is a very cool accent piece um, for any haunt or just decorating for a Halloween. Keep howling at the moon my werewolves, please comment, rate, and subscribe.